Inspire Guys People Takes Family. What's up, man? I'm Jay Will, host of Inspire Guys People, the podcast, where we balance faith and business to guide you to your purpose. And you are here because you are a part of this exclusive family. I'm listening to this audio book right now entitled Up From Slavery, uh, written by Booker T. Washington. This is one of my top five books of all time. Today is all about this quote because I think this is going to inspire you. And I'm gonna read the quote. I wrote it down so that I wouldn't mess it up. It is from the book Up From Slavery, written by Booker T. Washington. And here's what it says. I began everything with the idea that I could succeed. I've never had much patience with the multitudes of people who are always ready to explain why one cannot succeed. My man says this, he say he begins everything with the idea that he can succeed. He's saying this as someone who was a former slave, like he grew up in slavery, he had a bunch of things going on and I'm not gonna talk about them, no spoiler alert, alert right here, I can talk. It's the second part of this quote though. It's the second, it's the second part. It's the second part. Hey, it's the second part. It's the second part of this quote that like really, really, really messes me up. He said he don't, he ain't never had much patience for people who are always ready to explain why a man or woman, why someone cannot succeed. So not only did he say that he has the mindset that he goes into things, everything in life with the mindset and idea that I can succeed even when things are up against him, but he can't stand people or he can't stand, well, he said he don't have patience for them. Let me not put words in his mouth. He doesn't have patience for the multitudes of people who are always ready to explain why someone can't do something. When I tell you this might be my favorite quote of all time because I'm realizing in my life that I'm trying to live my life on this level of like doing what the Lord calls me to do. And I tell y'all, you know, you listen to the show. It's not on no fake stuff. It's not on no like, no, oh, everything's okay. Oh, it's good. Oh yeah, it's good. No, it ain't on that. It's really on some like, yo, I know that trials and tribulations come. I know that I'm not perfect. I've made a million mistakes. So it's not like lying to yourself and thinking that every day is perfect. But I'm trying to live in this mindset where it's like, no, but I'm not going to be discouraged. I'm going to have hope. I'm going to have faith. I'm going to trust God in the midst of these things. And so on top of that, sometimes what I've learned in this life is that I can, you know, Mr. Inspire Guys people like, you know, I'm always trying to like bring that vibe. And sometimes I feel like, man, like every time you tell somebody why they can do something, they give you three or four reasons why they can't do it. It seems like people take more joy in hearing why they can't do something because it seems to justify the laziness and the lack of effort. So today I want to inspire you and let you know that it is okay. I want to empower you too. Like it's okay to have a mindset when you're going into things like I can do this. I can succeed. 